Hi, my name's Dixon Cleveland. I'm the Chief Technology Officer at iGaze Inc. and I love every minute of it. In this video, we explore how eye tracking works. The basic purpose of an eye tracker is to measure where you're looking. When you're looking at a bunch of things on a computer screen, we want to know which one you're looking at. Here's a side view of what's going on. There's the computer screen. There's the user's eye looking, and there's his gaze line, and it intercepts the screen at the gaze point. So how does the eye tracker measure the gaze point? To begin with, there's a video camera located at the bottom of the screen looking up at the eyes where it's got the best view that it can of the eyeball itself. And a key part of the camera is an infrared LED and the equipment that we build at iGaze has the LED right in the center of the lens. So what does the camera see? Here's a picture of an eye as seen by our camera. Note that there are several interesting features of the eye image. First, the pupil looks bright. It's not the black pupil that you and I normally see when we look at each other. This is called the bright pupil effect, which is the deer in the headlight, headlights look. This happens because the LED is mounted at the center of the camera lens. To measure where the eye is looking, there are two critical locations in the eye image. The first is the pupil center. And the second is this really bright spot called the corneal reflection. This is the reflection of the LED light off the corneal surface of your lens. And here's the key to eye tracking. As your eyeball rotates around, the relative positions of your pupil and corneal reflection move around with it. Watch what happens in this video of an eye while the eye moves around. When the eyes look left, the pupil moves to the, to the left of the cornea. When the eye looks right, the pupil moves to the right of the corneal reflection. And when the person looks up and down, the pupil moves up and down with respect to the corneal surface. In summary, this motion of the pupil moving around the corneal reflection is the basic optical geometry that the eye tracker solves to figure out what direction the eye is pointed. This method of calculating the gaze is called, as you might guess, the pupil center corneal reflection method, PCCR for short. And that's how eye tracking works. Have fun playing with an eye tracker.